The first test tests for the in-place response forward. The examiner will stand in front of the patient, place one hand on each shoulder, and lightly push the patient backward until the anterior ankle muscles contract, then suddenly release. The examiner will not allow any pre-leaning by the patient. The examiner will score only the best of two responses if the patient is unprepared or if you push too hard. Okay, so you're just gonna keep your arms at your side and hold a normal um, posture. And I'm just gonna push you against your shoulders and you're just gonna not allow me to push you up back. The next test will test for in-place response backward. The examiner will stand behind the patient, place one hand on each scapula, and isometrically hold against patient's backward push until heels are about to be lifted, not allowing trunk motion. Suddenly release. The examiner will not allow any pre-leaning by the patient. Score the best of two responses if patient is unprepared or you push too hard. Okay, so please stand with your feet shoulder width apart and your arms at your side. I'm going to push on your shoulders and just don't allow my hands to push you forward. When I let go, try and keep your balance without taking a step. <laughs> the next test will screen for compensatory stepping correction forward. The examiner will stand in front to the side of the patient with one hand on each shoulder and ask them to push forward. The examiner will require them to lean until their shoulders and hips are in front of their toes. Suddenly, the examiner will release their support when the subject is in place. The test must elicit a step. The examiner should be prepared to catch the patient. So you're going to stand with your feet, shoulder width apart, and your hands at your sides. I'm going to put my hands here and push against you, and you're going to lean forward. When I let go, do everything you can, including to take a step so that you don't fall. The next test is compensatory stepping correction backwards. The examiner should stand in back and to the side of the patient with one hand on each scapula and ask them to lean backwards. The examiner should require them to lean until their shoulders and hips are in back of their heels. Release the support when the subject is in place. Okay, so I'm just going to ask that you stand with your um, feet shoulder width apart and your arms at your side. And I'm just going to push you from behind, and you need to do whatever you got to do to not fall. So if that includes taking a step, then go ahead. The next test will test for compensatory <laughs> stepping correction lateral. The examiner will stand behind the patient, placing one hand on either the right or left side of the pelvis, and ask them to lean their whole first heel body into the hand. The examiner will require them to lean until the midline of the pelvis is over the right or left foot and then suddenly release his or her support. Okay, so you're just going to stand with your feet down at your side and your arms at your side and I'm going to lean my hand sideways on your arm and when I let go you can use like a step to catch yourself before you fall. Okay, you ready? Push back against me. Beautiful. Okay.